So Samsung is focusing on AI a lot since S24 Ultra was a huge success in that department. They are now working on improving the S25 Ultra to be better and faster than the S24 Ultra by providing a major hardware upgrade with some new design changes. Get ready for some serious power with the S25 Ultra packing a whopping 16 gigs of RAM. And this isn't your average RAM, Samsung is stepping it up with the faster LPDDR6D RAM in their 2025 flagships. The last time we saw this much of RAM on a Samsung phone was the S21 Ultra. Now you may be thinking, do we really need 16 gigs of RAM on a phone? Well, when it comes to the S25 Ultra, it's not overkill, it's just a perfect amount of juice. The reason behind this is on device AI. You see, AI apps process tons of data super quickly, and while they run fine now, they will need more RAM as they get more complex. So, having a 16 gigs of RAM is actually a smart move to future proof the S25 Ultra, making sure it can handle new AI features without slowing down. The S25 Ultra is also getting a fresh new look that is definitely needed. Rumors were circulating that Samsung would be ditching the boxy design in favor of a more rounded look like the Galaxy Note 7. Ice Universe has revealed that the S25 Ultra will have a new frame design with a rounded back and a straight display side. This will make the frame thinner and reduce the bezels on the sides of the display. Can't wait to see how sleek it's going to be. Imagine the S25 Ultra as a blend of Galaxy Note 5 and the regular Galaxy S7, sleek rounded corners, slim flat frames that curves gently at the back. This fresh design ensures a more comfortable grip than the S24 Ultra. Moving on, Samsung might choose to keep the Galaxy S25 Ultra's battery at 5000mAh because of its rumored to be slim profile of 8.4mm. It seems like they are more focused on keeping the device sleek and stylish while also making room for the impressive camera setup and internal components. This decision might disappoint some users who are hoping for a large battery but this shows the balance manufacturers have to find between the pushing boundaries with innovation and the meeting the practical needs of smartphone users. So what do you think of this S25 Ultra's major upgrades? Let me know in the comments. With that being said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.